What was going through your mind on that last that last play? On the uh, whenever the guy yeah. tripped and my, sorry, when the guy tripped and they're yeah. trying to get the field goal. Yeah. I mean, I was I was sort of looking at the clock. I saw the guy trip. I was like, they're not going to get it off, and they didn't. So. Talk about your defense tonight. You guys, uh, you, you bend a little bit, but you, you held those guys down. And, uh, right. It's a physical ball game. Yeah. I mean, I think anytime you play Rice at home, it's it's always going to be a tough game. I've been here for about three years now, so um, it, 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 it's a testimony to this defense. It's a testimony to this team, the toughness and the grit that uh, Coach Wilson always talks about. And I'm, I mean, I'm proud of my guys. With the remaining games you have left, and now knowing you guys are in a four-way tie for the first, right. what's, the, what's the mindset now? I mean, I, I honestly don't think anything changes. I think it's the exact same mindset that we've been had, and it's uh, we can play with anybody in this conference, you know, anybody in the nation for that matter. But um, the mindset doesn't change. It's day in and day out. We do the little things that got us here, and we're going to continue to, you know, stack these uh, the little meticulous everyday things and continue to try to break. Hey, what was going through your mind the last second when they almost got the field goal? Right, I mean, honestly, I, I, I just thought, um, I, I honestly didn't think they were going to get it off. And uh, they ended up not getting it off, so um, it was it was good. It was a good way to end the game. It was a little, a little flavor way to end the game, so I mean, I liked it. Uh, Excuse me. I wouldn't. I wouldn't say fortunate. I think we earned it. You know, I think we earned every single bit of that. Uh, you work hard and you get what you put in. The goal on offense is always to score one more point in the defense, and the goal on defense is always to hold them to one less point than our offense. And so we did that. And, uh, that's the scoreboard shows that. When they when they stop the guys' offense after one on fourth and goal. What uh, are your thoughts going back out there? Count on me. Count on the Count on the defense. It's um, that's the motto. We, we went into the locker room and coach is telling us to look to the guy to the left, look to the guy to the right, and tell them count on me. And so, um, anytime a little bit of adversity hits like that, we just want to go out there and we attack it for this thing. Hey, can, can you guys did a good job after the early touchdown. I think 51 yards, they picked up the rest of the first half. What did you change for you guys? Um, we just there was a I think there was a few mental lapses. I think for the for the most of the duration of the game we played a good game defensively. I think what really changed was we had to focus on the, uh, little minute things like whether it be a bracket, exchanging guys, or bumping the coverage, and things like that, and really just honing in on your assignment and not trying to do too much. And I think we did that. Hey, can you try and describe the excitement in the locker room after the game today? It was crazy. I think if I had to give it one word, right, I'd say amazing. The, the, the energy was amazing. With the coaches in there dancing, about to about to cry. And I mean, so uh, hey, it's good anytime we can get a win like that and celebrate with my boys. Coach Wilson, yeah, Coach Wilson. He loves to dance. There's there's this thing where the, if the music doesn't turn on in time, he'll start clapping his hands, pump, 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 no music, and then we'll just we'll just turn up to that. So either way you go, that. yeah. Either way it goes, the energy was great. Talk about the fans that showed up here. Oh man, the entire time I say on defense, honestly, that was what that's what kept us going knowing that we could turn to the sideline in an away game and start doing like this, getting our hands up and, and making noise, you know? And uh, we had an incredible, incredible amount of people show up today to this away game. I mean, uh, we were joking around and we we're like, we're here at Rice and we have more fans than them. But uh, it was good. It shows the support and uh, Rhode Island Nation love it. Definitely. Just like I was telling him, it's always tough winning at Rice. So. Anytime we can do that, it's good, and it feels great.